Arts has asked me to make a tutorial video of how to attach your video of doing your music assignment to the actual assignment on the classroom. So I'm going to show you how to do it on a phone like I did. So you have to have, if you're doing it on a phone, you have to have the classroom and drive app like I do. But if you are doing the recording part on your phone and then uploading it to classroom on your laptop, that will be later in the video and I'll show you how to do that. But this is just with the phone if you have the classroom and drive app. This is um, easy, but the other way is easier too if you're doing the recording on the drive on your phone and then uploading it onto the classroom on a laptop. So I'll show that in a later part of the video. So first we're gonna do if it's all on the phone. So open your drive app and you're going to go, it'll take you to this page and you're gonna go to the search in drive up here next to your profile picture. So you're gonna click in the search box. You don't have to type anything. It'll automatically give you this drop box of the file types right here. And you're gonna go ahead and scroll down to the gray folders. So you're gonna go ahead and click that. You're gonna click the thing you want to connect it to. So I wanna connect it to the seventh grade music. So there you go. And then you're gonna go to the bottom right corner of your screen and hit the plus and it's gonna say create new and you're gonna use the camera since you wanna make a video and it will automatically start like this but if you want to turn it around it'll automatically be on photo but if you wanna make a video just scroll over to video like um, a regular camera on a phone and you're gonna go ahead and you're going to start the video so this is the test video so then once you're done with that, you can either use the video or you can retake it if you want to. So I'm going to use the video for the example. And it's going to process the uploads for a little bit. The longer the video, the longer it'll take to load. So since that was such a short video, it didn't take that long to load. So it's once it says down in the black um, tab will come up saying all pending uploads have completed, you're going to go ahead and tap on the latest video. So the one on the bottom will be the latest video so this one that says modified April 9th since today's April 9th um, I'm gonna go ahead and click on it and then you can go ahead and see your video the test video so there we know that it worked that it processed completely so then um, you're gonna go home if you have the both apps and then you're gonna go to the classroom and you're going to go to set, um, whatever subject you want to upload it to. So since this is the music one, we're going to go to music, the music classroom stream. You're going to go to your assignment that he assigned. So I, I had the drums assignment number three, rhythm and six beat. So this one. And he explained what to do and had some links and stuff. And you're going to pull up this tab at the bottom that says your work pull it up and it'll say add attachment right here with this plus um, right above resubmit or submit and you're gonna go ahead and add attachment and you're gonna click drive since you recorded the video through drive so I'll click drive you're gonna go to the classroom file and then I'm you're gonna go ahead and find the music so here's seventh grade music and then you're gonna go ahead again click the bottom video so you know that it's the one that you just made and you want so I'm going to click the bottom video and then um, there you go, it attached to the classroom. So that is how you do it. And then you would have a, um, a button that says submit, but and then it would say, are you sure you want to turn it in? And then you would click yes, turn in, and then it would turn in and Mr. Velez will be able to see it. Mine says resubmit because I had already submitted my video for my actual assignment. So since this is just a uh, example, that's what it looks like. So that's the way to do it um, with your iPhone if you have the Classroom and the Drive app. This is how to upload the video once you've done the recording on the Drive but want to upload it on a laptop. So this is the laptop I'm using. It's actually a Chromebook, but 
you're gonna go ahead and go to Google Classroom or type it in the search bar. So I'm gonna go to Classroom and it automatically takes me to Homeroom, but I'm gonna go ahead and click on Music and it'll take me to Music and then once you, or when you want to attach it, the video, you're gonna go ahead and add or create. It'll look like this, and you're gonna hit add or create, and then you're gonna go to Google Drive, and it'll take you to this box that says insert files using Google Drive. Here's the test video. So you can go ahead and click on the test video, and then it's gonna say this little add, and you're gonna go ahead and add, and then it's gonna add to the um, assignment. So that's how you do it when you have the app on your phone for the recording in Drive and you want to upload it on a laptop. So that's how you do it. Um, I think it's simple, but I hope you I helped you. Bye.